Hi, good afternoon. Happy World Water Day. I'm here today at the water couch with Plan the Netherlands and uh, basic water needs. Um, uh, and I was wondering if you could share with me an example about uh, uh, water cooperation. Uh, well, that we can do. Um, together we just um, have um, a new project. We started together a pilot project in India in which Plan in the Netherlands and Basic Water Needs work together uh, in the slums of uh, New Delhi to improve uh, water quality. And Plan is an NGO and we're very strong in working with local people and local organizations to improve their um, awareness about uh, water uh, hygiene and uh, the need for clean water. And Basic Water Needs has a lot of other expertise that we do not have. So this for us is a good opportunity to work together. Well, in short, Basic Water Needs is a company uh, that builds, develops and uh, uh, water filters for the bottom of the pyramid. Uh, we concentrate ourselves really on the household level, so we have small water filters that we produce ourselves in India, in our own factory, and that we distribute all over the developing uh, world. The main focus is Eastern Africa and uh, South Asia. And after having worked in the field for some years, we, we kind of discovered that if you want to work at the base or the bottom of the pyramid, you have to add more services to your customers than simply just producing filters and bringing it to people. So, uh, for instance, in this partnership, we start to train our partners and we start to uh, train them on technical skills on what constitutes clean water, how do you use a filter, how do you, how do you clean a filter, but also uh, we, we give them a little bit of more of a business background. How do you run a company? How do you, how do you, how do you sell something? Uh, and those are added values that we like, think that we, uh, that we need to bring in this marketplace because we see it as a market, we are a commercial company. And, uh, and that's how we teamed up together with, uh, with Plum to do this project. Uh, so this is a really good example of how the private sector and an NGO can work together. Um, what is the main thing that you've been learning from each other uh, in this cooperation? Uh, <laughs> well, there's good things and there's challenges. There's challenges yeah. as well, and but good things as well. Yeah. yeah. The, the, the good thing is that you really uh, there's a whole a new expertise with an NGO that opens up for you, and that's in case in this case it's social marketing. That's something that we yeah. do not absolutely not understand. Uh, so that's something from our side. That's uh, well, that's been a tremendous uh, experience for us. I think. Yeah. yeah. I think uh, some of the challenges are that. Um, uh, well, an NGO is not used to working with um, an, an organization that wants to make profit. And uh, in some cases, uh, also in India, you're kind of fearful to be uh, in, in a position that you are working with a partner that wants to make profit. But there's nothing wrong with that, uh, because we want to reach people and you want to improve their, their lives through improving the water quality but also by giving them job opportunities and that's exactly what we can do here so for us it was a, a challenge to uh, with the partners we work in India to show them that this is not dirty business this is good business and not all business is dirty and that is something that uh, I think we got through them and um, I'm quite sure we did yeah. and um, yeah that's this offers us a good opportunity to explore these new uh, cooperation. That's exactly why we're doing this pilot, to learn how we can do this. And for us, it's, it's more or less it's a new way of doing business. Uh, we always say that we are just, in, in Dutch we say schuivendoos, that means you're just shoveling boxes to your customers. Uh, uh, and, and we now have to take a, a far less black and white approach to how we do business in, in this segment that we operate now. That's been a real eye-opener for us. And we hope after doing this wonderful project with PLAN that we can copy this model of working with NGOs and, and take it to different countries and different places. Thank you so much for this interview. You're welcome.